Welcome to the Simple Object Designer. Hi, I'm Eric, and I've, I've created a new app. It's called the Simple Object Designer, and the purpose of this app is for you to be able to customize your business central in an easy and safe, secure way. Uh, and when I talk about business central, I'm talking about business central in the cloud. The Simple Object Designer is an app in App Source, and this is a the very popular term these days, no code, low code. This is it is a true no code uh, option for adding fields. So if you're working in other uh, environments like that, the, the Power Apps uh, family, this is the perfect companion for that. Um, you can add fields. You don't need to hire a developer to add a field or place something on the screen. Um, and you could be super user or the admin it's it's all contained within your organization and what you can do with simple object designer in this the first version you can add fields to any table any table you can place those fields on any page well on pages where it makes sense uh, you can place existing fields because business central is filled with tons of fields that are not necessarily surfaced uh, the way where you perhaps would want them. You can place them on pages too. You can also make sure that fields you have created have the proper options, like they're related to somewhere else in the database, so the data structure is correct. And we're working on a lot of new features uh, for, for the future versions of this. And I want to emphasize that what we're doing is that we're creating true fields in a true extension. We're not cheating. We have not a predefined set of fields on a predefined set of tables. We are creating fields just the same way as if you were to call me and say, hey, Eric, I need a field. That's what we're doing. And, and the code that is generated behind the scene uh, is generated the way I would write it if I were to do this manually. You have the option of, of working with this in one environment like a sandbox and then deploy it to production or you can work, work straight in production if that's how you roll. And why would you use the simple object design? Well, you keep control of your own customization. This is you doing this. It's nobody else. Uh, this also means that the, the app actually works Friday evening uh, and other times where it might be hard to get hold of me. Um, but the result will be the same as if it were m me who did it. It's, the, it's written the same way behind the scene. And I want to emphasize that, that this is actually not a dead end. Uh, it's not like you can get to a point and say, okay, now we need to take this to the next level. So we have to scrap what we had and then recreate it in a true development environment. What, you, what the simple object designer generates can be downloaded and opened up with a development tool and you can continue to working on it. So there's nothing lost. There's nothing that, that you have to scrap and your data is lost and all that stuff. You can continue when you outgrow the simple object designer. I hope that we will keep up with what you want to do with it. But if you outgrow the system, you can continue to work on the stuff that has been created with the object designer. So if that's interesting for you, take a look at hogarth.com slash designer or download the app from AppSource. The first field is free. And uh, let me know what you think.